On the speed bump. What up, boys? I think I'll clear it enough for you so you can save it for the next camp. I get your three. So. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I would say. That's what I would say. Probably, brother man. Yeah, probably, dude. Probably. Glory. So, is it less weird if you have an altar of yourself? Um, not really. Gilbert Gottfried ASMR room. I'm reporting you. I don't know where I'm reporting you, but you're getting reported. To some sort of authority. So. Enemy missing. You know. Ah, uh, Harris chilling mid. <clears throat> All right. Pew. Pew. Yeah, let him come into the light. Bathe in the glow. No eyes on the law right now. Bathe in the glow. Okay. So would a generic anime room be better? Or is it still okay to focus on that specific anime? I mean, I think the more generic you get, the better. I think, I mean, I, th I would stick away from having an anime room at all. But I think you're better off having a, a like a full fledged lots of anime room than you are having a specifically one anime show room than you are having one specific character from that show. See see how it gets creepier and creepier the more you go down? The deeper in that rabbit hole you go, the more it gets strange. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Phew. You should have a single room dedicated to literally everything so it's not creepy at all. Exactly. Exactly. Just have one giant room with everything in it. That way it's your all your rooms and so it can't be weird. Unless, of course, you have now dedicated this room only to beanbag chairs. Because now it's the weirdest thing it could possibly be. You've peeked out on your weird. So. Um, Hera does have beads. Okay. Hmm. Enemy missing right. Nothing really for me to do right now this game. This ground is sacred. This ground is sacred. Would a house with no walls be a room? Yes, it would be a house that is also a room. Yes. How many how many rooms does this house have? One. Yes. Okay. You it would just be like a big square. I can't look towards right lane. I got nothing else to do. Are they staying? Enemy spotted. Cool. Gank right lane. Okay. Hmm. 
Oh, baby. Nice job. Let's go. I didn't know the Jingwei was going to get pulled, too. Oh, that's excellent. That is excellent. They must have already burnt her beads. Mm, mm. It was right when he hit five. Oh, baby. It's called a studio. Yeah, they, they call it a studio. A studio, a.k.a. a room. Yeah, exactly. It's just a fancy word for room. Your throat is in no condition to do a Gilbert Gottfried impression. Nobody's throat is ever in a condition well enough to do a Gilbert Gottfried impression. I am not with you guys. Unfortunate. At least we got the red buff. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So. All right. I gotta get out of this Kukulkan form. This is my least favorite form. This is my least favorite. You're expanding the room right now, Iris. You've expanded the room too far, friend. Too far. Holy cow, that's so much damage. Alright. Um, let's get some wards out. Nice job. Heading back mid. Yo. I think you have to stand still, Thirsty. I haven't actually tried it while moving. No, you have to stand still in order to do it, which is obviously, you know, not the play. <laughs> so. So, realistically, you can never actually use it because you have to stand still. Red buffs are coming up soon. I am here. Oh, nice. Oh! Uh, <laughs> My dude just walked right into it. He just, he said, he said, oh boy, I love shiny ult. Holy cow, just, I've never seen somebody so confidently walk into a Kukul. Like, that was, like, I mean, every once in a while you walk into a Kukul on accident, but that's like, he, like, he sees the dragon, cut like, right, and he just, he just, like, he, like, jumps to, like, he, like, sprints. I don't even know. That was... That was crazy. Yeah, he just sauntered right into it. Yeah. He's, he's not going to waddle away from that one. Yes. My lord. Guys, we got to take so much damage from that. Freedom! Poor guy's level 6. Complete it. Oh my god, I hit them both. They are super low under tower. Argus ult down. That's those Hera ult and Susanna ult down. And I did hit them both. So Hera's just backed. I'm backing up. Alright. Back up. Okay. Let's get an Aegis online. I'm gonna go right into the Shaman's ring. Cool. An enemy has been slain. Get to work on that.
We all have a bucket list, and that guy's was get hit by a dragon. And he did. He did, man. He achieved his dreams. Overwhelming splendor. Oh. That speed that she got from that. She got just enough speed from her shield. Oh, there's a couple of shields. A uh, Hera shield plus Geb shield equals a really large shield. <laughs> Just in case anybody was wondering. And if you were to throw a shell on top of that in a Book of the Dead, I'm going to have like three health bars. So... No, I isn't a lot right now. Holy cow, Kakulkin 1 hits so disgustingly hard. God, 500 damage on a 6 second cooldown right now. And a 50% slow. Such a crazy good ability. Is this the ranked? I've never played a game of ranked in my life. I only play Assault. I only play Assault, friend. Oh my god, that HP! Sunday, I'm gone. Uh, I maybe could have gotten away with that if I would have played it just a little bit better. I think maybe the idea was there. So. I think I just needed to be a little bit more proactive and then probably like... Instead of running away, I think if I would have actually engaged on them, I might have actually been okay. That's right. Sucks a little bit that the, uh... Suzano didn't die to the ulti, lived like 1 HP. That's okay. <laughs> exactly, Salah. I don't want to! This is my favorite form! <laughs> so... We've got really good deep wards out right now, so. Hera shield down. That's so much damage. Yes. Hera Aegis down. Susano's diving mid with Geb. Enemy missing left. Hera Aegis down. All right. Basically, anytime you want to kill her, you can. She probably backed, but. I, mean, I just poke him and poke him and poke him. So. Harris, come back mid. Oh, I'm dead. That's unfortunate. That is Susana ulti down. That is Hera ulti down. There is three people middle. Ha. Huh. Yeah. This, uh, this Hera's kind of getting her butt kicked. And so they're just sending their entire team mid. They're just kind of sending the entire team. You know? I'm sure. Oh, baby. Yeah, that RDO was diving 100% for Arthur. Oh, he stopped. He stopped. You're good. Alright. Ha. Huh. Yeah, I think we should probably get grouped. They seem to be doing a pretty good job at uh, getting grouped right now. Pretty good. The fact that they have a Hera and we have a Fenrir... And we didn't camp him is a little bit upsetting, considering how bad Fenrir beat Hera, but that's all right. That's unfortunate that there's a creep here, but... That's a 
dead already out. Uh, Susano ulti down. That's all I got. Okay. That's his dashes down. He's still got to look towards right side. He might stop for like a purple or something. He did. I'm a genius. He is still over here. Nobody came with me though. I am all alone. Okay. I feel like I'm making a lot of calls and we're not really... Huh. Alright. Well. My confidence in my team is 0%. I have 0% confidence on anybody on my team to do anything this game. So, As far as I'm concerned, I am playing 1v5. I have no confidence. There is a Hera at my red buff. That is her ultimate down again. Okay. Well... So is anybody in comms or my I'm talking to myself, right? I'm talking to myself. I hear you, brother. Okay. Okay. I feel like, this, I feel like, I feel like if you can hear, this is physically impossible. Like if you were deaf, I get it. But if you can hear, I just don't feel like this is possible. You know? I just, I just don't get it. I don't know. Okay. Huh. All right, all right, all right. On my way. Um. Can't believe Hera literally invaded my red buff by herself and got away with it. By herself. As a Hera. As a Hera. There's two people middle. That is Susano diving for me mid. I smashed them. Okay. That is the 19th gank from Susano on the mid lane. We still need to get grouped as a team. <laughs> I just, I don't know what to say. I literally don't know what to do. Gab is mid under the T1 and he has an Emperor's armor. All right. He is rolling out mid lane. Yeah, he's. That's a free gap. There we go. All right. Hera's mid under tower. The T1 has zero HP. We just insta kill it. Okay. Hera has no ulti because she's on me earlier, but she has her actives up. Oh, okay. Or ulti's back up because she's Hera. Never forget. That's her Aegis down. She's dead. Nice. Yeah, Jingwei on our right side. There's two people coming down mid lane right now. Right to you, Susano and Ardio. Tornadoing them off. They're the stock. We can find this, boys. We got 5v3. 5v3. They're going to look possibly for me and I'm ulting through on you guys in the back line. Got Susano and Ardio. Beads down on Susano. Ardio dashed down. Geb is back up, but he's the only one. There's the Geb shield. Uh, we can do Fire Giant, probably. Yeah. Yeah, let's go. Much better. That was way better. Way better once we got grouped, you know? Once we got grouped and just started, like, fighting, like, ah. I felt like I felt like a team, baby. I felt like a team, you know? We're making team plays and everything. I felt good. I felt good. That's what I like to see. Yeah, let's get out. Cool. Cool, 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 and fantastic. All right. I'm feeling much better now. Uh, I don't know the Gold Fury spawn timer. But we can probably group and shove mid and right so we can be ready for it. Make sure we buy sentry wards. Uh, Susano seems to be the uh, the target, if possible. So, let's get that one going. Gold Fury just spawned. Cool. 
Yeah, I, I wouldn't get it, Wally. So. We can just do gold. RDO still left as well. Jingwei is pressing up hard with Hera. This is actually a good fight. Turn five this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Keep fighting, keep fighting, keep fighting. Yep. Oh. All right. Well, that's Susano ulti down and stuff. Oh, here he comes. That's him. <laughs> he just walked through my entire team. Oh, okay. That is so awkward. That we did not put him in combat when he walked by three people. Oh, to come for your boy at 400 HP. Oh, man. Oh, God. Well, that was a fight with Fire Giant. 5v4. Yeah, he's just straight to gold. Oh, actually, they got everybody out. They're going to fight AMC right now. They're just going to full dive him. Yeah, that was some crazy pathing from Big Mike right there. Oh, man. Oh, wow. Yeah, left was not the way to go. Oh, man. He passed alone into the left. We got to go defend it now. Alone into the left side jungle. Oof. Okay. Oh, God. Not during Street Week. Oh, this is the worst. Trying to get Argus off you. Okay. All right, their entire team is literally Susano. Like, that's it. We kill Susie, we win. We don't, we lose. It's their entire team. So. <laughs> I gotta get a man to the Discord next. So I don't get one. Actually, I can probably get a Book of the Dead. I don't think they'll be able to one-shot me, so. They should be able to proc it. We should probably get grouped around the fire. Thanks. Yes. We need wards. Your right tower is under attack. Your left Gab is backing right now. Ardio's coming in Your from right top left. She's by herself. Your left tower. Nothing. Nothing. All right, Susano's over mid still. He will rotate, obviously. Just looking at Ardio for now. That's her dash. I'm holding through. I might get a lot. Oh, Ardio! I got uh, Susano on me in the back line. He is slowed. He is slowed. He has no. He has no beads. He has no nothing, dude. Got him. We can do fire giant again. No. Attack fire giant. On my way. I got a sentry for it. It's not a spotting it. We can do portal while we wait. So. Hey, how are you doing, Bleach? We'll have our AMC here to help us as well, so. Alright, perfect. Fire giant's about to spawn. We've got a good ward coverage out too, so. There we go. Uh, we should probably back and buy first. All right, well, keep working on Book of the Dead. That was another good fight for us. That was another good fight. I really like a Kulkin right now. Like, obviously you're susceptible to dying, but I just, I don't know if it's just the skin. That's so cool. That makes me like him, but like, I feel like he just—he just hits so incredibly hard. Like, you get so much magic power on Kukulkin, just by nature of your passive. Feels so good.
feels so good to have like a thousand power, you know. <laughs> Thoughts on Polly? Um, it's good. And it obviously scales super well with Kakulkin because of how much magic power he gets. We should group up shot right. But I tend to get a little more defensive at the end of the game with Kulkin than offensive. Standardly, I would like to finish with something like a Book of the Dead Mantle of Discord because you can't do damage if you're dead. Um, but I have, especially in games where I feel like we have no like objective damage, like say we had a Merlin uh, uh, ADC, so we don't have like any tower damage. In situations like that, I often get poly because you can auto attack poly proc a tower for like 500 as Kakulkin. So. But if I feel confident that we have enough, uh. Oops. Uh, like Phoenix damage, I would prefer to not. Careful. We can't really get in on this right now. We got Ardia on the back line, ulting through. Got two. Hey, Susano as well, actually. Susano had to read back. Oh, this is bad. Holy. We got to back up, boys. Susano's going to come in full HP and everything. Careful. He's coming in. He hasn't used anything. We have Fire Giants. So we can sustain, but there it is. Okay. Ugh. Yeah, we're gonna have to be careful about how we engage on those. We can just go step left now. Gonna have to be careful. Um. I'll be able to play a little bit more aggressive once I finish this Book of the Dead. Not a ton, but a little bit. So that's nice. So we can get Book of the Dead going and grab a sentry ward. They're on gold, but it's not that important. We just go left. Is this my go-to build on Kukulkin? Yes, it is. This is my standard go-to build. Obviously, the most common change you're going to have to make is finding a way to get a Divine Ruin in your build. If they have healing, you know. Uh, but they don't really have uh, healing that I'm worried about on this team. They've got like the RDO healing, but... Can't heal if you're taking a thousand power ulti to the face. Got him. He's dead. Let's go. Shove and left, baby. Let's get here. I don't want to get picked off. Shoot. They're going to send a lot of people here out there. We should probably chill. They've got at least three over here. Gab. Ardio, Susano. Susano might look for me. Not yet. Geb shield down. Okay. We got 30 seconds on Hera. Why Shaman's Ring, not Spear? I don't really know how to answer that question. Those, those are not related items. Looking at Geb. Oh, there's the Susano on the back line. Aegis. Nice kill. Looking at Ardio on the back line. That's the dash. Oh. Looking for it. Got them all. Oh, that's Aegis on Jingwei. He got him. Yeah, I'm dead. Maybe not. Oh. 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 Holy man. How are we not even getting a Phoenix off of this? I can't do that any better, unfortunately. That's as good as it gets. That's as good as the fight gets from my perspective. So, thank you, DX Baby, for the sub. Do you appreciate How are you doing? How are you doing? All right, now I'm just working on a mantle of Discord, baby. All right, we got to get grouped up for uh, Fire Giant. So, 
Uh, back at it again with the Twitch Prime. <laughs> back at it again, DX. How does he do it? Gab is over right lane for now. They don't have good vision on this. Hera's moving up way too far. That's her beads. That's her Aegis. Got him. Looking at Ardeo. She's a half. She's slowed. That's Jingwei's one down. That's a good pick off again. I'm worried about Sus. We can come back and look towards fire. That was Aegis and Beads down on Hera as well, by the way, so... When she respawns, they'll be down for another solid minute. This is big fire, which is super nice. I'm gonna grab some waves mid. Um... I gotta get a full mantle of Discord. Start ranking up our actives. Um, yeah, we can push up waves and do gold if you want to. Or we can just look for a pick off in the jungle while we wait for it to spawn as well. We can, like, hide around in this region waiting for it to spawn. So. Woo! Cuckoo does so much damage late game. Cuckoo does so much damage the second the game starts, basically. Like, the second Cuckoo gets, like, level 2, Cuckoo does so much damage, you know? Yep, yep. A light in the darkness. Overwhelming splendor. All right. Time presses forward. Overwhelming splendor. So. All right. Bloop. About to spawn. So is our red buff, eh? Red buff. Alrighty. I guess we come with the next wave. Alright. So this is our red wave. So that's the wave we want to push with. I already have their or our red. You can take that one. Got my purple pot and everything. Let go. Let go. Now right, we're about to get red wave in mid. That's red wave right. That's red wave left. Attack left lane. Get a little blink. Some good poke. Okay. We got, we got some magizes down. You can go left. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the red wave of a left, so. I hit Jingwei with some poke. Yo, Ardeo blinked mid. She blinked mid. She's on us pretty deep. Nice. Jingwei's really out. Oh my god, that's her Aegis. I think she's dead anyway. She is. Fight mid. Yep. Old thing through. Got Ardeo. Gab yeah, and Ardeo kind of zone. Argus in the back line. God, that's so annoying. Okay. Looking at Hera. She's slowed. She's Aegis on Hera. She actually might die anyway. I got a Susie on me. I Aegis is ult. Hera has nothing up. Look at that Hera. Can he get her before she gets back to base? I'm on the Titan. Titan voice, Titan voice, Titan voice. Oh, God. I'm going to die, but that's all right. Forget about me. Just kill Titan. GG's. Oh, all right. That game went 10,000% better once we started, like, working as a team, you know? Once we got grouped up, it was infinitely better. Infinitely. So that was good. 
Good, 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 good. I'll take my 15 MMR. 46,000 damage. Holy. That's a lot of damage, man.